What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Moto WordPress Themes and in today's video you're gonna learn how to use any font into your WordPress website. I'm gonna divide this video into a series of some videos so you can make it easier to find and to locate what you are in need but the very first step is go to WordPress dashboard plugins add new and this is gonna be the setup and install process. We're going to be using a free WordPress plugin that is called Use Any Font. This one that appears in WordPress dashboard plugins, add new and search for this field. It has thousands of sites and very good rating. So I do recommend that you use this plugin to apply customization of customized fonts. You can even apply Google Fonts in the case that you want. As soon as you install it and click to activate, you're gonna be able to see a new button into your WordPress left sidebar of buttons. And the plugin is now active. We can click right here to view the details. Custom font uploader. If you navigate down, you can see the new field called use any font. And the very first step that is the most important part of the setup process and installation, it's get your API key. This key can be free or free for one custom font upload or premium for multiple fonts. Once again, of course, there is no free launch, so we need to be aware that there is premium versions and there is in-app purchase. But note, the API key is really important. So you can generate one for free. Just click onto this button. As soon as you click on it, you can get your unique font. And after this, click on verify. Now we already have our API key. And now we need to upload fonts, but I'm gonna share more parts of the plugin, like the instructions where the plugin developers share how to do the most important parts. And in the next video, I'm going to explain how to upload custom fonts. And in the last video, I'm going to explain how to assign custom fonts into your site. But let's explore the plugin settings by now. Use alternative server. This can be used only if you have the API key verified. And to load things from all other out server. Use PHP uploader. This is when you do not have this already uploaded. No need to change. Disable font list into WordPress editor. If you upload fonts, you can see a button or a block into, into Gutenberg's with the custom fonts. So you can select and apply the fonts. You can disable this. And the last option that is one of my favorite ones, it's the integration with uh, language switchers. And it is. This is the settings. Nothing to do right here. By default, the plugin that works great. So. It is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. And don't forget to check out the visualmoto.com portfolio of amazing WordPress themes with full compatibility to this plugin and many others. And I see you later. All the best!